We all know that the Balanduru Lake is one of the most contaminated lakes in the city. What was once a beauty has now turned into an eyesore thanks to its massive pollution and contamination. But wait, here are a set of students who have come forward with a solution to cleaning it up. Engineering students of CMRIT presented an idea of fly ash which is derived from burning coal that can be used to purify water and also in the making of durable bricks. This idea popped up when there was a conversation between a lecturer and his students in the class about the bad conditions of Belandu Lake and other lakes like Yamaluru Lake and Varturu Lake. Uh, basically, the, uh, the project started with a Belandur Lake cleaning where uh, we have polluted water in uh, Belandur, which is polluted by, by different sources. So what we are claiming here is the fly ash, which is a waste product that is taken from thermal plants. We can use this fly ash and clean this particular water, which we have shown as a demo. So this fly ash has a property where it can bound all these uh, harmful uh, effluents or any harmful organic matter that is present in this particular uh, water. So this fly ash, once it has been bounded uh, with this organic uh, chemicals, uh, we claim that this fly ash is again a waste product. So we are using this uh, fly ash again and use it for making the bricks. Here are the visuals of a student showing the demonstration of water purification using fly ash. What is the connection between fly ash and water purification? Well, here is the answer. Fly ash is made of porous content when mixed with water toxic content sticks to the fly ash and the water is filtered. Then we get purified water which can be sent to the lakes. After the water was purified uh, using fly ash, this fly ash was uh, a waste. Fly ash is actually a toxic material. When left in the air, people if they inhale it they will get asthma. So what we thought of instead of letting this fly ash loose, we uh, use this fly ash to make bricks. So also I found a lot of uh, waste uh, plastic found uh, fallen near my house. I thought why couldn't I use this? So after four months of continuous vigorous testing and uh, preparation and uh, experimentation, we could finally get our bricks done. Fly ash along with plastic is mixed in equal ratio to make durable bricks as well. This innovation has even been recognized by the Portugal government and the students have even won a gold medal at the India International Innovation Fair. The Karnataka State Pollution Control Board has also applauded this innovation and is thinking to implement it in the near future. Hopefully, this will be a long-term solution to the existing problems of lake pollution. Prasanna Gaonkar for News 9, Bengaluru.